Alright, so when I went in there, they said, like, as I was walking in, two other dashers walked in behind me. Um, I'm not doing DoorDash in the morning anymore, so I guess those are orders I would have got, but I, I don't care. DoorDash has crap in the morning, and I'm not taking crap. Oh! Alright. Oh, God, look at you going. So I just got that one dropped off. Uh. Ironically, a box of donuts going to the dentist's office. <laughs> All right, I just want to say whoever works for Instacart, like, this order is in Northeast Washington, D.C. That's a 40-minute drive on no traffic. Right now, it is 7 in the morning. You will definitely hit traffic. Definitely an hour, hour and a half drive. Why am I seeing these orders? Like, why am I getting... Why do I get notifications every day for this Walmart? I, there, there is not even a thought in my mind that I would ever go to that Walmart. Why am I getting orders that are like, here, let me, let me GPS it just to see what, what it actually says. All right, I just got this Instacart. It's four items. Took two minutes of shopping. And I tried to pause my DoorDash and I guess I hit end dash on accident, so that's it. Man, it is cold. All right, I got the Mick Craig. The Mick Craig. drop off this one kind of sketched me out because it's on the main road but they got a nice driveway so it's safe rare super eats duncan it's going to the ice rink which is like a mile and luckily, Duncan wasn't busy, so all good for five fifty. All right, man, these kids drive so reckless coming into this ice rink. Like the dude, freaking <laughs> behind me. They must be late to hockey practice or something, because dude coming in behind me was like trying to run me over. And then four kids hopped out the car. And then the dude was like, just leave my order at the front desk. And then the lady at the front desk was like, who's that for? And she was like, he gets breakfast all the time. All right. Had to drive quite a ways to get to the safe way. But I'm really hoping this order has bonus pay or hidden tip on it because if it doesn't this is a bit much but whatever you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes all right i got this starbucks man this starbucks i just thought about it. this starbucks was closed they remodeled it for like six months it was closed and I would get orders all day, every day from Uber from this Starbucks while it was closed. And you know, people talk about, I saw in Pedro's video, people were saying that they get priority on Uber because they have a higher acceptance rate. But, but how many terrible orders are you taking to get that priority, to get that higher acceptance rate? I don't believe it. Sir, 
All right. Three drinks. But it was already ready. It took me like six or seven minutes to shop. Had to replace one item. Man, that camera's looking a little dirty. There we go. Had to replace one item. So, I don't know what I'll get paid. After I dropped that last one off, I got this. This one that's absolute garbage going far. It's on the back road though, so I'm not too mad about it. It's just a waste of time, is the way I see it, because I'm going to drive all these miles and make six bucks. <laughs> 